traffic has been our friend so far, to be honest. I remember coming out to Southeast Asia about three years ago, and it took me two and a half hours from the airport just to get into the city center of a city like uh, Manila or Jakarta. And I think that's where we all realize that convenience for people who have busy lives and families must be a key driver for how they will consume in the future. And um, with our promise of next hour delivery, with our deliberate choice of using bikes, I think we have grown because of, not despite the often very horrible logistical traffic situation in the countries around us. When you get to the Philippines, are you rolling out deliveries nationwide or is it just going to be a Metro Manila thing? So we're starting with Metro Manila um, and then we will broaden our coverage as we have in other uh, countries. So we went into Indonesia, for example, started in Jakarta. Back end of last year, we've just opened Surabaya. And within Jakarta, we have broadened to the broader uh, Jakarta era. And I think that will exactly be what we were doing in Manila, start with central Manila and then gradually expand our coverage. Marcos, what makes Happy Fresh different from other grocery, grocery delivery apps? What we focus on, I think it's really two things. Customer experience across the whole spectrum of shopping online and then also the delivery of your fresh product to your doorstep next hour or any other one hour slot of your choice. And secondly, the aspect of the personal shopper. We employ people who we train in our in-house academy to be the best pickers of fresh fruit, vegetable, meat and fish so that whatever arrives at your doorstep is of the highest possible quality. Other traditional retailers um, or supermarkets as well are adopting e-commerce platforms to augment their business. In the US and the UK, supermarket chains have been making their inventory available online as well. How does this play into Happy Fresh's strategy? We are partners of retailers. We're very deliberately not a retailer ourselves, but the front-end customer-facing digital and service element to an existing retailer. So if you look at any of our markets where we're present across Southeast Asia, be that in Indonesia, or in the Philippines, or in Malaysia, or in Thailand, or in Taipei, what we do is we partner with the best local and international supermarkets on the ground to extend their offer and their brand and their um, reputation into new customer groups and onto the digital platforms. Do you think your brand fits perfectly here in Metro Manila? When I first came to Manila quite a while ago, I you know, encountered a city that was full of young international people, more and more single um, and single generation households. Uh, women make a huge part of the workforce today. And you have a lot of couples who are stressed for time and who uh, appreciate convenience and who have a very international outlook who are very mobile and very digitally savvy. And I think you know, that together with the fact that everybody in Asia loves food uh, will make a great market for Happy Fresh, I'm quite sure.